Hey everyone, this is Paul from Ortho Eval Pal. What I want to do today is show you what a medial meniscus bucket handle tear looks like. Nick here is 21 years old and two weeks ago was playing disc golf and had a wide stance and when he went to throw, his knee buckled, his foot was still planted, had a significant pop and a severe amount of discomfort in his medial joint line, anterior knee area. Um, continued to kind of try to function on it and had a very difficult time, went into a walking clinic um, and then ended up in physical therapy. Had an MRI recently to confirm our original diagnosis, which we thought was a bucket handle tear. And this is why we think that. When he came in, we noticed the knee was just slightly warmer than the other one, indicating that he had some synovitis, some inflammation around the knee. He has a little bit of swelling in there, but here's the thing. I'm going to ask you to bend your knee on your own as far as you can. So slide that heel toward your bottom. We have really good motion here. Okay, now go ahead and straighten it out all the way. And then it gets stuck right there. So he cannot fully extend it. It's actually a little bit better today. He's at about minus or he's lacking about 30 degrees of extension. Um, it was actually stiffer than that two days ago. Now, here's the thing. If I try to extend him it gets very sharp, okay? And so I, I don't get that nice springy capsular type of feeling. It doesn't feel like when there's a lot of swelling in there and the swelling is preventing us from straightening it out, is literally locked there, okay? We cannot straighten it out any more than that. Um, I also checked his collateral ligaments. So medial collateral, not too bad. Lateral collateral, I can't straighten him all the way out to do the capsule because he just won't straighten all the way out. Um, I was very concerned about his ACL when he first came in just because of the mechanism of injury. Um, he had a pop, the foot was planted, the knee caved in uh, immediately, but he has nice stability of his ACL. There's not a lot of laxity there. There's a nice little end point. So I'm not so concerned about that. So our suspicion was a bucket handle tear of the medial meniscus where he has some palpable tenderness. I already went through this. I'm not going to put him through it again. Um, and, uh, and so he's going to need to have surgery to either have a repair or have a meniscectomy. And that's going to be coming up really soon. So um, we are not going to try to push through this because that's not going to be very helpful. It's just going to inflame him more and it's going to cause more irritation, more swelling and a significant amount of pain. So that is what a bucket handle medial meniscus tear looks like.